Today I wanted to talk to you about imposter syndrome. If you are expanding in any way, if you are developing, pushing yourself into your discomfort zone, you will come across times where you feel like a bit of a fraud, a bit of an imposter, and you will have a sense that maybe you're not actually as qualified or competent or confident as the people around you believe or expect you to be. If you have that feeling, here are three things I want you to remember. Firstly, you have the exact same traits as the people that you admire most in this world. We are all complex humans with a wide array of traits and characteristics. Sure, yours may be expressed in a different way and your qualities may be triggered by different situations, but you are just as talented and gifted and creative and persevering as anyone that you admire. Remember that. Secondly, it is not what you're doing that makes a difference it's the who you're being so it's not the what you're doing it's the how you're doing it that makes you unique and wonderful and amazing so i want you to think of a, a concert pianist or an opera singer now that you may have two different performers and they are performing the exact same piece people have heard it before sure but they haven't ever heard it done that way when we have performers like that, it's not what they're doing, it's the special qualities that they bring when they are doing it that makes the difference. And that is the same for you in whatever it is that you are choosing to deliver into the world. It's who you're being and how you're delivering it. Thirdly, please remember that life is actually about joy. It's so easy to take ourselves really seriously, especially when we are trying to expand and develop into something greater and you can get really serious and go, oh, well, I'm not doing this properly and I should be better at this. How about you just get playful with it? How about you let it go, get a bit more lighthearted and go, do you know what? I'm feeling like I'm a little out of my depth here. Why don't I just play? Why don't I just see what is possible and what I am capable of and bring a little bit of lightness and a bit of joy and playfulness into the situation. There you go, three things to remember if you are ever feeling a little bit of imposter syndrome. Take care.